Let's talk knee bracing. Big problem with any kind of knee brace, any brand, any style, all it wants to do is slide down. That's the biggest problem that we see. Main reason for that, everyone, that upper thigh a little bit wider than that lower leg. So all of us, we all kind of taper down. Naturally, just wants to have that brace sliding down. At Donjoy, DJO Global, our solution to that is called our anti-migration band. Essentially, that's a strap sitting right below the knee, right above, right before that calf starts rounding out. So that's kind of the one spot that we really have to grab on, hold on, prevent that brace from slipping and sliding down. After the first time that you put the brace on, you follow your order of strapping, it will settle into position, but once it settles, it shouldn't keep slipping and sliding down. Biggest frantic phone call that I get is if that anti-migration either comes out of place, slips off the brace, or patients that receive their brace in the mail, they're taking it out of the box, out of the bag, and they're curious, how do I set this thing up? So, when we get a brace delivered, what we want to do, we want to open, this, open the bag up, open the box up and everything. You're going to see your knee brace, but it's also probably going to have a spare set of pads, straps, and everything. For our sports braces, soccer, football, everything, that band, that anti-migration band, it might be all black, it might be black and yellow, that's usually already on the brace. Specifically for our OA bracing, our arthritis bracing, a lot of times that band is in a separate bag. So first thing that I like to do, take everything out, the pads, a little grip, silly grip material, those, we just pop right on the brace. And work our way down, put these things on. Biggest issue, that crazy black strap, that anti-migration band. All right. First thing that I want to do with this brace, like I said, right below the knee, that's where that band is going to sit. So these straps, everything has little numbers on them, little stickers, little numbers, so there is a sequence to put it on. That also helps us when we're putting this band in because what I want to do with that number four strap in the front, I want to open that up. I like Velcroing that little tab of Velcro back to itself so it's not getting snagged up when I'm trying to put this thing on. Same thing in the back, number five. I want to open that up, attach that little strap end back to itself. All right, so now I'm looking, these two straps hanging out. Our anti-migration band, what I want to do, big strap, one side's going up against the skin, one side is actually how we attach it to the frame. The side attaching to the frame, we have these little loops that these gray straps will go through. All right, so the easiest way to put this thing on, I want those little rings, those little loops on the outside. I want to make a big circle with this band, with this strap. Very first thing that I want to do, number four, you'll notice there's one strap that kind of looks in the front, one strap, two straps in the back. So what we end up doing, number four will actually go through that single strap in the front. I just want to do a quick check right here, make sure once I feed that strap through, that that anti-migration band is actually going to open the same way that that strap does. Go back to that ring, that helps me put it in place, go around back, those two rings are sitting in the back, perfect spot for that number five to pass through, attach it to the frame. So essentially that anti-migration band, that black strap, it's overriding, it's taking the place of number five. Number five now is how I attach it to the frame. We even tell patients on our little cheat sheet or a little uh, instruction booklet. Once, we're, once we do that initial fitting, we really don't even need to mess with this number five anymore. That's what's going to keep it in place. But if we make the mistake of opening that up, that's usually days, weeks later, that's when I'll get that frantic phone call saying, you got to help me out, put this thing back in place. Now that we're in, open up in the front, just like that. Now I mentioned all these straps, they have an order or sequence to go through to put this on the right way. So it stays in place, gives you the support protection offloading that you need. Number That black one doesn't have a number on it. I start calling it strap zero, basically circling around that whole leg. All right. Plus, down here they label number one. So black strap zero, one, two, three, lock it all in place with four, five we don't even need to touch anymore. All right, so we'll try and get you guys an up-close little perspective here. So when I make that little circle, those little loops, they're all sitting on the outside of that brace. Okay, and we can kind of notice that one in the front, two in the back. When I open this thing up, it's going to open in the front. So, again, brace sitting, number four, number five. And depending if you have a left or a right leg knee brace, that strap might be on the other side. So that's why we always do that little quick check, make sure it's going to open the right way, the correct way, in relation to that number four strap. Okay, so we fold over that strap end, just so it doesn't get snagged up on anything. Same thing in the back, fold that back strap end over. All right, 
flip it, rings on the outside, single ring, number four goes through, okay? Kind of wiggle that into place, flip it around back, okay? That number five in the back, you've got these two straps right over here, go through one of them, go through the second, at that point, that's when I'll open that strap end up, feed it through our little swivel tab over here. I might have to wiggle things into place, get any wrinkles out, just so there's no skin irritation, no rubbing. Ask about those lycra undersleeves. Open up in the front. We got strap zero, number one, two, three. Lock it all in place with four. Five, we don't even need to touch anymore. Five's just keeping it to the frame.